Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys for my new subscribers. Thank you guys for following me. Thank you guys for uh, watching my videos. Thank you so much. Um, I took a little break for a couple of days, but I'm back. And I did notice the uh, Heroku is no longer free. Uh, so I've been searching online. I mean, still, Kuroku is still a pretty good place to deploy your applications. The only thing is not free anymore. Um, let, me, let me bring the volume up on this. So I went online. Uh, let me go back over here. I went online and I checked. There's a couple of places, uh, but I found this one here. I don't know if you guys want to give it a try. But this is called a smart ASP.NET account. So um, yeah, it's called a smart ASP. So anyways, I decided to try. It gives you it gives you like three months, and I deployed the application. And it works pretty good. Um, this is the one the application that we've been working on it. So if you uh, if you watch if you uh, have watched my videos before, this is uh, e-commerce. So I actually have deployed the application here. So if you guys want to try it out, it's free. It gives you all you got to do is register and deploy it here. And the application, I have it deployed here. So, yeah, see, this is the application right here. I got the, yeah, see the products. See, it's pretty good. Oh, that was the wrong one. My bad. All right, so here, yeah, see, you can click on details. Yeah, so you can go, I can log in on my admin panel. Let me try it. Admin panel. See, I can do that. So, yeah, I mean, you can deploy the front, the whole front end, your uh, ASP.NET Core, and you can actually use SQL Server on this application. So, it's not bad um, for free. I mean, for a few months, and it's very simple, very straightforward. Um, so, if now you stick around to Heroku. Anyways, in... Don't forget to check out the videos, but yeah, this is that's the application. And also, if you want to, um, also wanted to show you guys another thing too. Okay, so this is my this is my personal personal website. It's called Martin Devs. Um, I'm still working on it. Still, I I did a, quite a few changes on mine. Um, I have. Let me see what else I got. You can send me a message through here. You can reach me through here. Uh, you can email me. Um, also, have a, I created a page for every time I deploy something on the, um, on the GitHub, it actually shows the repo here. You can actually go to the repos. Um, I wanted to show you guys another thing, too, uh, in my uh, GitHub. If you actually log into my, um, if you actually go into the my, my GitHub and go to my re, uh, repos, and over here, uh i have like i didn't realize i had that many many projects here i forgot that uh i i done so many since started work working with uh uh javascript and asp.net core i have like i don't know if you if you're new to web developing so you can actually go here and i have like little mini projects there you can actually check it out and and i even have a light demo here so if you actually go you can actually go to the light demo See, it shows you there. You can actually check it out. And I have, I think, um, since I started working on that, when I was learning JavaScript, um, I think I did like like bunch of videos online. And so there's bunch of bunch of them there that you can actually check it out. Uh, yeah, like I have one. It says online store. Let me see this one. Uh, yeah, it's just like little demos on it that I've worked on. The, and they're all in the GitHub. You can actually check it out, check out the code if you want to uh, go ahead and clone the project if you want. You can do that if you want. Let me go back. Let's see. Um, I made one with tables with uh, with uh, jQuery. Uh, let me see. Uh, I have another one here uh, with jQuery effect or JavaScript effect. Let me see. It's not. Ah, it's not doing it. Why is it not doing it? Let me see. Um, yeah, I guess I got to go back on that one. But there's, there's a bunch of projects there. If you guys want to check it out, check out the code. Um, this one's called Photo Gallery. Yeah, you see that? When you hover effect. 
yeah you see pretty cool if you want to if you want to grab some of the code there see if you like it whatever um let me see i have this one's called e-commerce site ah that's pretty cool some of them some of that that i watched somebody else to do when i was learning so but i put it all all in one particular one so if you guys want to check it out um and then uh see what else i got so let me go ahead and close this up i mean you guys know my channel there don't forget to like subscribe and again the link on this one here i'll leave it on the bottom of the video so you guys can uh go ahead and register and, and create a free account it gives you one free account and you actually you can uh deploy your database and you can use a uh, sql server and it's very straightforward very simple um so let me go ahead and close that. Let me go ahead and close that. That's Heroku. If you want to stick around to Heroku, and you can always uh, watch my videos how to do it. So uh, have, check out my channel and actually I explain how to do how to deploy it in Heroku, your uh, ASP.NET Core application. So let me go ahead and close that. That's just my my demo running in my local machine. So. Yeah, that's that. Let me go ahead and close that one out. Yeah, so again, don't forget to check out my repo there for the little projects if you're just starting. But yeah, but anyways, that was it. I wanted to give you guys a, a little tip on uh, I'm working on the next video so that way I can connect the Stripe to the um, to the application and I'm, I'm redoing the whole admin panel. So uh, anyways, guys, stay tuned for more videos um, and I'll try to... I'll try to um get back with you guys uh with the um with the next video how to connect the Stripe to the uh, e-commerce website. All right, so stay tuned for more, and uh, I'll see you guys on the next video. All right, if you have any questions, don't forget to email me something or send me a message. All right, have a good one. Later.